Hey guys, I hope everybody's having a fantastic weekend, fantastic day. Whether you're watching this in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the evening, I'm glad you're here. I want to take a quick second and say thank you to the channel members. I want to take a quick second and say thank you for everyone who comes in to check out my knife, my EDC content. It means the world to me. If you're so inclined, if you'd hit that subscribe button and that bell notification icon, if you haven't had a chance yet, that'd be awesome. Today we've got a unique unboxing, something that's been kind of calling my name. Not budget, but not premium, um, from White Mountain Knives. And so I pulled the trigger on it last week, and we we're going to get into it. Take my Amazon knife that I always forget to put in my description. I'll try to remember to put it in. I think it's called a Tacre, or not Tacre, but something like that. I'll put a link to it in my unboxing. So what we have here is a funny colored Vostead box. It's been a while since I've had a Vostead. I have uh, been talking to those guys and they're in between model years so they haven't been able to send anything out. So I've been searching around and came across this guy and it was one I'll be honest with you, it didn't drive me crazy, but it made me very interested because it's got a couple of uh, uniqueties, I guess you'd call it. Let's see if I can get it open. All right. So, what we have here is nothing on there. Except a little box. Nothing on there. I was afraid of that. Open the joy swish. Open the joy swish. Open the joy swish. So this is that. I think it's called the uh, Vancor. With the uh, pivot lock. Again, this is just an unboxing, guys. I'll know a lot more about it when I actually do the review. Because um, I am going to review this knife. It definitely feels beefy. It is the Vosteed Ankylo. That's what it's called. The Ank Ankylo uh, Elmax Satin Blade Gray Aluminum Handle. Yaddy yaddy. I did want to upgrade. They've also got it in, I think, 154 or 14C. I did want the LMAX version because this may be a keeper, depending on what I think about it. I haven't bought a knife in this price range, and I want to say it was right around 140 150 bucks. Perfectly centered. You've got this gray aluminum, which I liked. Got a regular button lock, flip button, or traditional opener, front finger. And you've got that nice pear-shaped opening hole. And guys, the lock is in this pivot. So I push that, it allows the pivot. Seems like a strong lock. It's definitely an innovative lock. Not broken in yet, but on the uh, blade side, it's a satin blade. Let me wipe it off. It's got some oil, earl on it, which is not a bad thing. This dirty rag, but it's better than no rag. So it says Elmax and Vosteed. Multiple deployments. I was not expecting that. You've got the traditional low profile flipper. You've got the front flipper, you've got the middle finger flick, you've got the thumb flick. Really cool shape. Guys, I'm so far not at all hating it, and I wasn't sure when I bought it because it was a lot of money for me right now. Ooh, ooh. Guys, it's a therapeutic slicer. 
from the factory is the therapeutic slicer. Holy smoke. Well, it is a flat ground, I believe, but it's got very good blade geometry and a very keen edge. Very sharp. Absolutely slicey, and I'll make a pun and say dicey. It's got a full deep carry clip, but it doesn't come all the way to the back of the knife. So you're going to carry it to about right here. Um, there are steel liners inside these aluminum handles because this knife's got a little heft to it, which I like. It's not a light knife. It feels like a tool. Um, again, this is not a review, but I can show you real quickly what it weighs. Four point eight ounces, roughly. 4.8 ounces for a, excuse me, I just freaking hiccuped. Three and a quarter inch blade, seven and three quarter inch overall knife. I really like the size. I really like the lock. I don't see how that would get in my way when I was cutting at all. Now, I don't know what it would be like to be left-handed, but for a righty, I love that pill-shaped, kind of pear-shaped opening hole. Makes it really easy to get in there. Gosh, this thing drops like a... There's absolutely no friction there. And I'm horizontal, guys. So if I go vertical and just push the button, nice knife. This is the uh, Vosteed, uh, what do we say it was? The Anklo, Anklo. We will check this out. I like the little frowny face with the torch screws. We will check it out. Looks like T8s all the way around, including the pocket clip. They may be T6s. Um, I'll throw it in my pocket, take out my little CJRB, which you haven't seen the unboxing on that, so I'll put that out of the way. Okay, this bad boy, and I appreciate you guys taking a chance to watch my video, my unboxing of the Vosteed Ankylo. I don't know how to pronounce that, but anyways, thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're so inclined, please hit that subscribe button. Please hit that bell notification. Feel free to thumbs up or thumbs down the video if you're so inclined. But most importantly, please look out for the guy or gal to your left. Please look out for the guy or gal to your right. Please look out for each other. Go forward with love in your heart and choose debate, not hate. I love you all. Peace.